What's up everybody? Chris with South Carolina Gun School and I know a lot of y'all have been asking, you know, where where I've been. I know some of y'all have been wondering why I hadn't been putting up uh, too many videos. I've just been, after October, it has just been wide open for me. Um, with the holidays, then with um, holidays, getting everything ready for this year and stuff, it's just been crazy busy. As you can see, I've got my eyes and my ears on. I've been out here filming a couple of videos, so I'm getting ready to get back into the swing of things, and the SHOT Show had me pretty busy and stuff. Um, trying to get my mags reloaded and ready to go, but it's just... November, December, and January were just really, really busy for me. And, you know, I apologize, y'all. I know I've been wanting, there's a lot of videos I've been wanting to get out. I've been wanting to do a lot better um, with the videos. And one of my New Year's resolutions for this year is to um, start out at least, you know, one video a week. So I'm going to be doing a lot better getting out videos at least one a week if i can do more i'm definitely going to do more um of course the first one uh this one's probably going to have two videos in it uh, it's going to have this video that i'm doing now and then um i'm also going to have a video from this past weekend's class um up because we were out running and gunning in the snow so everybody was having a good time Sorry, I'm getting my rounds ready. Getting my hollow points separated because I took out my hollow points before I started shooting. So yeah, the, you'll see this video um, and then you will see uh, another video coming out with the uh, group that I had over the weekend, this past weekend. So you'll see that. Um, matter of fact, what I've been out here filming right now, give you a little preview is got the Hellcat, got the Canic TP9SC Elite or Elite SC. So I did a little comparison video um, with these. I've been out here just videoing some of the shooting stuff I was doing with them. And then we're going to head back up and kind of sit and talk about the guns and everything as well so give you a little preview that's what's going to be coming up is a little comparison video between uh, the Canic and the Hellcat there's been tons of videos out there with the uh, Hellcat and the 365 but I figured I'd be the uh, oddball here and do the uh, Canic and the Hellcat because I know Canic's the SC I guess is their kind of competition to the Hellcat you know some people call the Hellcat and the 365 a a micro compact but it's, it's all to me it's all subcompact you know we can get all you know we can get all over with the the fancy names and stuff but it's it's a to me it's just a subcompact so did a little review of that of course the hellcat's mine the canic is my brother's i borrowed it from him but uh, that's another reason i'm out here is we're doing we're going to be at the gun show uh, this weekend, Greenville, South Carolina Gun Show at the Greenville Convention Center. So if you're local and you want a good deal on classes, come out to the gun show and get signed up. If you're not local or you can't make it out to the gun show, uh, I'll be running a special um, online as well, too. I will say the ones that come out to the gun show and get signed up, the uh, deal is going to be a little bit better for you there. So uh, online, you're going to get uh, up to... 30% off classes and then uh, if you come out to the gun show and sign up there you're going to get 50% off classes so and there's always good stuff to look at at the gun show I'm chasing rounds around trying to get my mags look duh, trying to get my mags reloaded for my carry because the Hellcat is my new carry gun so I'm just trying to get all my magazines reloaded While I'm doing this so that's done but yeah we're gonna be at the Greenville gun show 
Uh, I'm not sure exactly where the booth is. I'm going to go up and get set up today. We'll be there um, starting tomorrow. It opens at 9 a.m. till 5 and then 10 to 4 on Sundays, but we'll be there both days. Again, up to 30% off online if you want to get signed up, and then you get 50% off if you come and sign up at the gun show. This special will only go on uh, through the weekend. So as long as you're signed up for a class uh, by midnight Sunday, uh, you will receive uh, it at the discounted price. The website will be updated with the online discount, and then I'll be applying the discount if you sign up there at the gun show. Uh, if your schedule doesn't really match up and you're not sure you know, what you'll be able to take, but you want to get it at the sell price, go ahead and get signed up. And if you just want to go on the registration page, pick a date and get signed up, and then just shoot me an email saying, hey, I'm not really sure when I want to come. I've got a list of people that have done that where I ran the special uh, last gun show in last month where they weren't really sure when they wanted to come, but they wanted to go ahead and get it at the sell price. So got them signed up. I've got a spreadsheet set up with everybody's name on it and email and contact info. Uh, and I'm staying in contact with them, trying to find them days where we can get them out here. So if you're not sure when you can take it, what your schedule is going to be like, then definitely go ahead and get it at the sell price. I'll be glad to send you a gift certificate so you've got that for your records if that's something that you're you're wanting to do. Um, Dan, I know I've mentioned this in the live video last night. I'm going to be going live and talking more about that. If you're local here in Anderson County, uh, they're going to be presenting the Second Amendment Sanctuary County Ordinance uh, to the County Council Tuesday, February 18th at 6 p.m. So if you can come out to that, come join me as well as other supporters of this ordinance here in the county on Tuesday, uh, February 18th, 6 to 8 p.m. I want to say the address is 101 South Main Street. It's right across from the uh, new courthouse. It's the old courthouse, actually. Uh, but you'll, I'm, pretty much, you'll see, I'm pretty sure you'll see everybody out there. But if you need help or if you just want to come and see what's going on, definitely come out help us out get the voice heard there's a petition that i've posted on my business facebook page personal facebook page our gun school instagram and twitter page go in and definitely get that signed as well too and if you're wanting to know how to uh, get this started there's plenty of places out there gun owners of america will help you out if you're local or if you're here i shouldn't say local if you're here in south carolina uh, south carolina carry organization is the one that's presenting this and helping get this organized and get it out there. They've helped Horry County. I think Horry County's coming up on their second reading of this ordinance. So we all see what's going on in Virginia and that's, you know, kind of opening doors for other places. And it's, I don't know, it's, it's not a very good thing right now. So we need things like this. We need to get out there and we need to get more involved with defending the second, not really just the second amendment, the constitution in general, but uh, definitely the second amendment because that's a big thing under attack right now. So if you can make it out to that, again, Tuesday, February 18th, 6 p.m., uh, Anderson County Council building. It's 101 South Main Street, I want to say is the address, uh, but it's all posted on the website. If you're local here in Anderson County, we've got a group set up. If you want in the group and I haven't added you, shoot me a message i'll get you in that group because there's a lot of discussion going on there but if you're wanting to know how to get more involved with being a second amendment advocate or defending the second amendment uh, gun owners of america here in south carolina you got south carolina carry organization uh, firearms policy coalition there's great great groups out there become members get involved with them as a place you can start but more importantly you need to start locally start locally to make the biggest impact don't think you're going to go up and walk right on to Capitol Hill and make an impact. Start locally and then we can work our way to the big dogs. Uh, but again, Greenville Gun Show this weekend, website specials, gun show specials. Uh, don't forget we've got Kevin Dixie's classes coming up. I'm hosting him. He's got his Evolve Pistol 1 March 7th. If you want to take his Evolve Pistol 2 in May, You've got to have the Evolve Pistol 1, and then we're going to be hosting his Evolve Rifle 1 as well in July. Homepage on our website uh, down under SCGS News has all the links and information on that, but feel free to reach out with any questions. So a lot of great things are coming. I'm trying to work with a few other instructors and host them, so 
be on the lookout. Uh, we're going to be partnering with a local instructor here, start offering some gun, class, uh, gun cleaning classes and things like that, and more advanced classes. We're getting all this stuff ironed out. But yeah, a lot of good things are coming. We're growing. We're getting bigger. We're going to start offering more, so be on the lookouts. And always remember, folks, if you're not shooting, you're reloading. If you're not reloading, you're fighting. If you're not fighting, you're dead.